Hi, I'm Donald Wade, and thank you for joining me for today's daily devotion for Thursday, October 15th, 2020. The psalm for this coming Sunday's worship is Psalm 96. Now, the message of Psalm 96 is a reminder of who God is, what God has done for us in the past, does for us now, and will do for us in the end. And Psalm 96 also tells us some things that we, as God's people, should do always and everywhere. Our voices should break forth in singing God's praises. Our thoughts should be on how great and how mighty God is. Our hearts should bow in reverence before God's holiness. And we should look forward with delight to the Lord's day when we can join with the saints in singing God's praises. So join with me as I share with you Psalm 96. O oh, sing to the Lord a new song. Sing to the Lord all the earth. Sing to the Lord Bless his name, tell of his salvation from day to day. Declare his glory among the nations, his marvelous works among all the peoples. For great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. He is to be revered above all gods. For the gods of the people are idols, but the Lord made the heavens. Honor and majesty are before him. Strength and beauty are in his sanctuary. Ascribe to the Lord, O families of the people. Ascribe to the Lord glory and strength. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due his name. Bring an offering and come into his courts. Worship the Lord in holy splendor. Tremble before him all the earth. Say among the nations, the Lord is king. The world is firmly established. It shall never be moved. He will judge the peoples with equity. Let the heavens be glad and let the earth rejoice. Let the sea roar and all that fills it. Let the field exult and everything in it. Then shall all the trees of the forest sing for joy before the Lord, for he is coming, for he is coming to judge the earth. He will judge the world with righteousness and the peoples with his truth. Let us pray. May God's steadfast love and righteousness bless you and keep you. And may the majesty and glory of God be on your mind, in your heart, and in your song always. In God's holy name we pray. Amen.